Hi guys, so today I'm doing a look inspired by Melanie Martinez's film K12. Um, it's a great album, I'm so happy she's back. I bought tickets to see her in December and I'm very excited. I'm just gonna get into that. What is this? Okay, I need to stop getting distracted and I'm gonna begin. So I'm just gonna start with my normal foundation and concealer. So the concealer I'm using is Revolutions Concealer and it's in shade C1, so it's the lightest shade in the range. definitely has product on her eyebrows throughout the film but they're not super defined so I, I think I don't think she used dip brow or anything on her brows to make them super super like defined and perfect so I'm just gonna use some brow powder to create that look are very simple um, in the video basically it's a pale pink eyeshadow I think um, and then she's got a little bit of eyeliner on it's not too winged out and she has a small pair of false lashes on I think and she's got like little eyelashes coming down but that's easier to draw on with eyeliner rather than using little lashes to put on because if they're not small enough they look really strange and nothing like how she has it in the video um so that's what we're going to be doing for the eyes <laughs> i'm so awkward why do i keep doing like this and all these weird hand movements i'm so sorry um but yeah let's move on to the oh my god i'm doing it again so i'm using the shade pinky promise from beauty bay's own palette i use this so much so it's got a little bit dirty um but they have a really good palette well i think they have about three of these they have the big one, the medium one, and the small one. I have the small one, so it's the nine colour palette. Um, and I really recommend it because it's very pigmented for the price. And it, yes, it's great. Thank you, Beauty Bay, for this blessing. So that is literally all I'm going to do for the eyes um, in terms of eyeshadow, of course because it is very light and very pale and there's not a lot going on it's more of a simplistic look and very kind it's slightly natural it's not completely natural there's just not a lot there if you feel me um i think it just really represents crybaby as a character i guess um by keeping it simple and light and yeah very light colors because that's very cry baby's thing you know um so eyeliner now and i'm not used to not doing a wing with eyeliner so we're gonna see how this goes Got like a tiny little wing on there it's very very small it just goes out a little bit here i've just got a brush and i've kind of edged around it to kind of bring the wing down so it's starting to come down here but you don't want to go across the eye because then it's a little too thick for crybaby um now i'm going to just draw on the little eyelashes on the bottom so can I stop ending my sentences with doing this? It's, I'm literally annoying myself, I'm so sorry.
Now I'm going to put up, put up, sure. I'm going to put on some small lashes. These have kind of fell because I've used them like twice. Um, and I'm really bad at taking care of my lashes. But these are from Primark and they're actually amazing. Okay, so that is the eyes done. And I'm going to move on to blush and contour it's not like extreme contour i'm basically just gonna frame my face um i know you usually do this at the start but because i am really bad and i constantly put my hands on my face when i do makeup i put the, my contour on last but i don't do extreme contour anyway and it's very light contour in the video so it's fine to do last honestly just do what you're more comfortable with i guess and what you prefer to do So I put blush from my cheeks upwards because there is a lot of blush going on um, because it's just Crybaby's thing, you know, um, it makes a lot of sense. Um, and now I'm going to put some highlight on and then we've got the lips to do and we're finished. I'm also going to get changed into something more K12 vibey and I'm going to try and put my hair in like the pigtails this is really great pigtails but mel has pigtails up here you know um so we're gonna do that i don't have a black and blonde wig i do have a blonde wig but it's it's not great it doesn't go up here i'd have to put it like down here um so i'm just gonna keep my natural hair um plus i'm not going exactly for crybaby's look i'm going for inspired so for my highlight i'm gonna use on a high by skinny dip and i'm gonna use the shade ice queen um because it's very glowy and white and it's not too harsh um so it really suits the look that we're going for so for the lips i'm just gonna use a what was that I'm just going to use a clear lip gloss um, because that's what Mel has in the video, in the look that I'm going for. Okay, so this is the makeup look done. Sorry, my hair is bugging me so bad. But this is the makeup. Um, now I'm going to sort my hair out, get changed and I'll be back. So that is the end of the video, this is the completed look. I hope you enjoyed and if you did please give it a like and subscribe if you are new and yeah thank you. <laughs>